Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are just joining me now then I would love it if you would stick around and hit the subscribe button. Also it would be really kind and really nice if you would go and follow me over on my Instagram. I'll leave it up on the screen somewhere now. Today's video I'm going to be doing six spring outfits. I have done two other videos similar to this where I've done an autumn one and a summer one. So yeah I'm just going to get started with this first outfit. Now I just think when it's this kind of weather where you don't know if it's going to be you know a little bit breezy outside but it is still sunny because today is today is the like hottest day that we've had so far it's 15 degrees and if you're in another country that might not sound hot to you but over here that is really good um and there's no wind so whatsoever so this outfit is not for today i would more wear you know i might chuck this on say if we're going out for a walk in case it does get windy but i'd probably wear this with like a little t-shirt or something like that but this, like I said, is more for the days where it's maybe got a little bit of wind or a little bit of a breeze, just so that you need something just to chuck on if you're feeling a little bit chilly, but it is still sunny. And I just think it's really nice having like a little cropped jumper, something like this, with a little bit of belly on show, and then a nice tight skirt. This is from Missy Empire, and this is a Gymshark hoodie. This is a very old hoodie. But I'm sure that they do have similar ones now. I mean, they might have ones with a zip down the front now, but I'll try and link something similar. So, yeah, it's just, I love this. It's so comfy. I like the little slit at the top, and I just think it looks really nice. I think I'd probably wear either a pair of, like, grey trainers or something, just so it kind of, like, all blends together, or this kind of colour trainer, which I don't actually own. So, for me, it would be either grey trainers or white trainers. But I think with this sort of outfit, I would want to wear, like I said, grey trainers, something beige. I do have some beige kind of boots, so that would be another idea. But I don't know if I'd want to wear boots with this skirt. So yeah, I'd probably wear trainers with this. And yeah, this is my first outfit. I do have another option of jumper, which I would say, I mean, it's not a jumper, sorry, sweatshirt. So obviously this is hoodie. And then if I was thinking maybe I didn't want my stomach out, I'd probably wear something like this just to chuck on and it sort of it sits like with this tight to the stomach so it kind of rolls up a bit like that and I have been wearing it recently so there's a little bit of a mark there but I just think that would also be a cute look I think this would be nice with my white trainers and this skirt so yeah just two options of just trying to make it so that it's suitable for when the weather isn't too hot I think I, I'm definitely one of those people that need a jacket or a hoodie. I get cold quite easy, so this is something that I would be wearing on a day when it's a bit breezy. So the next outfit is this gorgeous Jack Wills bodycon casual dress. I love it, it's so figure hugging. I did get it in a size lower than I would normally get, so I got this in a size 6. I would normally opt for like a size 8, but it looked big on the hanger. So yeah, I did go for a size six. I feel out of breath. Ooh. So yeah, I went for a size six and I'm glad I did because I just feel like it fits me way better than a size eight would have. And it doesn't ride up at all because of it being a bit tighter. I don't know if a size eight would have rid up, do you know what I mean? So yeah, very happy with this. And I just think it's very, very spring based, isn't it? Very summertime, very spring with all the different nice little bit of purple and the stripes and they're like what do you call this colour like a it is definitely green but it's like a greeny blue it's very nice and to go with it if it gets a bit chilly there's this jack wills cardigan i never really used to buy anything from jack wills but when mummy when me and my mum went shopping i think around november time last year we went into Jack Wills and I was like, oh, there's, there's some cute pieces in there. So yeah, this I just think is really nice. Nice thick knits just to chuck on over the top. And again, I'd wear this with white trainers. Or if I had some white boots, I think that would look really good. I kind of really want to invest in some nice white boots. So yeah, love this outfit. This is definitely one of my faves. And I think it's just nice to have something just to chuck on. Nice big chunky knit. And it's nice and fitted on the arms, that's another reason why I like it. It's not too oversized and overpowering, it's really nice. And then I like these tortoise shell buttons, I think that keeps it really natural and nice. 
So yeah, really like this. So this is outfit number three. I don't know if in the camera this is looking black, but it is a navy blue. I just love pairing navy blue with green. I just think the, the two colours go really, really well together. And this top I got from Free People. And I just think it's so, so comfy. They do it in so many colours. And I just love this sort of boat neck look. I just think it's really flattering. And I'm just wearing it with a simple bra underneath. And it's just the same at the back, really nice. Oh, cover that. And yeah, I just think these are just a really nice piece together. And these are shorts, they look like a skirt, which I really like, but they're short. So I am more of a shorts kind of person than a skirt person, just because I feel a bit more safe in a pair of shorts. And I love the fact that from the front, it does look like a skirt, so that's really good. A skirt, should I say. And yeah, I love this. Love these two together. I think with a tan, this will look amazing. I say that with everything, but I do feel better with a tan. Right now, I'm a bit of a milk bottle. But yeah, love this. Love these. This is super soft material as well. So stretchy. I also got it in a pink and a white. So yeah, I feel like I'll probably go back on the website and order some more because they have some really, really good colours. And it's just a super simple piece just to chuck on. And these, this skirt, sorry, skirt, is super comfy. It's a little bit big, but because it's, I don't know, it's good material, it's good quality from Sheen. And I know everything on Sheen isn't good quality, but this is one of the pieces that is good quality on Sheen. And yeah, really like it. It is stretchy, it's got some stretch. And yeah, really, really like this. Got a nice little zip at the back, so it's easy to get on and off. And I'm glad that it's not super tight on my tummy. I don't like things being super tight. I just think it just gives it a bit more comfort when there isn't a super tight band around the top. So yeah, stays up, doesn't fall down. So that's what you want. So this next outfit, I feel very beachy. I love this top. I actually got this from a charity shop and I'm obsessed. I love this top so much. I'm just wearing a nude bralette underneath, the one that I've been wearing pretty much through this whole haul. And I love it so much. It's one of those where it's like, it's got no tag on it. So you can have it high up and low at the back. Or you can have it low at the front and higher up at the back. I quite like it being high up and then low on the back. I just think this is such a nice outfit i love this sort of outfit these trousers are so so nice they give such a nice shape they're nice and flowy love them these i got from bershka in a size small i'm guessing this is also a size small but like i said no targets from the charity so i'll try and link something similar if i can find something similar sorry if i can't but yeah love these trousers go with so much stuff and they are so so long not the fact of like they're not i'm five foot five and a half and they're not too long in the sense of the dragging on the floor but they just hit the when i've got no shoes on they do hit the floor so when i've got my trainers on they are the perfect length so you just see if you're wearing boots or trainers you just see the little bit of the front of the shoe and i love that i just think it looks so good so i think these with a pair of slides or sandals would be really nice as well and yeah i'm obsessed I say that about everything but I just love them they're just such a nice they just give such a nice shape on your body and you can see that I've worn them recently because there is a mark on them don't know how I did that my beige I love my creams I love whites I think we know that by now and I also love my greens so for my fifth outfit we've got another skirt this one is from Zara unfortunately I don't think they do this anymore but there is so many nice skirts on Zara at the minute so if you like this or you're thinking I want a good skirt go check out Zara because they do some good ones but yeah I love this it's got a nice little wrap detail and it's nice and frilly at the bottom and there's so many cute I don't know if you can see so many cute little fruits on the skirt so there's so many nice little colours and little flowers so that's why I've paired it with this yellow sort of racer neck top I think it goes well with the score so I think it looks really nice and it's super breezy flowy dead comfortable love the shape it gives me and yeah, I just think this would be so nice on a day when I want to go on a dog walk with my mum or if I want to go out for a coffee or the shops, anything like that because we can do little bits like that now. So that's good. And yeah, I just think this is just another easy comfy chuck on outfit. I just love my comfy outfits. If I'm not comfortable, I'm not really happy. So all of my outfits are comfort based as you can probably tell. So yeah, leave down below which is your favourite outfit out of the ones that I've shown 
and I'll number them on the screen so then you can just say which one's your favourite one. So for my last outfit I thought I would show something a little bit more fancy because I haven't had any chance to wear this yet which is really really sad and I'll leave the sizing up on the screen just because I don't know if I've mentioned every single one so I will leave the sizing up on the screen but yeah this one I got from this dress I got from Princess Polly and it is so so nice it's tight here and then obviously not tight at the bottom but it's not see-through it's really nice I am wearing nude underwear so that it's pretty safe it's quite structured around the boobs so I mean they are quite squashed down but it's got this wiring detail underneath and I just chucked it on with this cardigan that I also got from Princess Polly I did say Princess Polly didn't I not oh Polly it's Princess Polly and I just think this looks really cute together I think if this was buttoned up as well I think that would look really nice but yeah obviously you know I love green and yeah this one is probably my fave out of all the outfits I know it's completely different this is my fave just because it looks the most fancy and I haven't worn anything like this in ages but I love this one and I can't wait to actually get to wear it out because it's super nice and doesn't just want to be sitting in my wardrobe all the time does it so I do think that this outfit is something that you can dress up and down I think with a pair of heels dressing it up pair of white trainers and white socks you can dress it down I just think it's one of those versatile outfits that you can I think it's just really nice and yeah super simple easy I do like simple pieces simple outfits like I said comfy outfits that's sort of my vibe I like to go for so that's all the outfits I have for you today if you did enjoy this video then please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and thank you so so much for watching and I'll see you next time bye